What's up guys, you know that I'm a big fan of Tally, a tool to create free forms online. And today I want to show you something new. Tally launched Insights, a powerful features that show you exactly how people interact with your forms. So if you're collecting leads, running surveys, or just want better results, this is a total game changer. Some days ago, I created a form to recruit people. Yes, so I went on Tally and I created this form called Looking for a Job. This is a very simple form where I collect some information about people who are looking for some work. And at first, I gotta tell you that results were really bad, really low. Simply because the form wasn't sexy at all. I was asking a lot of different questions. It was very long. I spent a long time writing a long and useless form. And finally, I succeed to arrive to the best form that I could create. And how did I succeed to do it? Simply by using their new feature called Tally Insights. Insights is the analytics part of every form that you are going to create, which is really cool with those analytics, is that I figure out that people were coming from actually mobile. So my form previously was very long and I understood at some point I got to make something way, way shorter. Sometimes just rewriting can fix everything. Basically, these jobs will be remote. So it's very interesting because most of the people are coming from India, France and Italy. It's a very good insight, especially if you want to try to hire somebody in the same time zone as you. And you can see where your form had the most impact. Obviously, it's in France for me. And also on what browser there were an operating system if you look for those metrics. Which is really cool also is that I have shared my uh, tally form on LinkedIn. And as we can see, most of the people who submit came from LinkedIn. But the real game changing tool, it's the question drop off. If you click here, suddenly we can see that we got new analytics. We have actually the user story of the form. What does it mean? It simply means that we can see where people drop off and where people put answers. When a user land on my form, is going to read and is going to fulfill every input, every select. And after that, I get all the data into the submission tab. With a question drop off, I can see where people dropped off. So drop off, it means that people are going to leave the form. And obviously that's not what you want. And we can see here that it's the question where there are most drop off. So it's a very good insight because probably we can improve that question. And we can see that we got a total completion of 75%, which is pretty good. So this question drop off tab is really useful if you want to improve the effectiveness of your form. To summarize, I just used the question drop off view and spotted where people were dropping off. Insights was the feature we needed to optimize without guessing. If you don't know Tally, I highly suggest you to try it. There's a link into the description and post a comment about what you think about this tool. Is it useful? And I see you next time. Bye.